there, I'm Maria, and today I'm going to show you the 17 affiliate marketing stats you need to know. Affiliate marketing has experienced incredible growth in recent years. If you have a website or are thinking of building one, you should be aware of affiliate marketing programs and how to take advantage of them. But you probably have a lot of questions. Questions like, what industries have the best affiliate marketing programs? What kind of affiliate marketing content works best? And just how much money can an affiliate marketer make? To answer those questions, let's look at some affiliate marketing statistics and what you can learn from them. But before we get too far, let me share this quickly. With Kinsta's affiliate program, you can earn anywhere between $50 to $500 in commissions, depending on the plan, for every signup along with 10% recurring commissions. We offer monthly payouts, which are automatically sent via PayPal. And because we consistently make our clients happy, we have a low churn rate, meaning you bring home consistent income. Make sure to check all resources linked in the description and remember, subscribe and ring that bell to get notifications for future helpful content. Now, let's look at those numbers. The current global market size of affiliate marketing is over 17 billion. That's up from 13 billion in 2016. The American affiliate marketing market alone is worth over 6 billion. There's a lot of money changing hands in the affiliate marketing world, and you can get in on it if you have a website with an audience. 31% of publishers say that affiliate marketing is one of their top three sources of revenue. For 9%, it's their top revenue source. Affiliate marketing is one of the best ways to monetize your content. Unsurprisingly, in the same survey, 62% of publishers said that e-commerce is one of their top revenue sources. E-commerce and affiliate marketing are closely related, and the effort you put into one can help you make more money from the other. Both involve using your website or other marketing tactics to promote products. The difference is that e-commerce involves selling your own products, while affiliate marketing involves selling someone else's. Affiliate marketing is the most important customer acquisition channel for 20% of brand marketers. 54% rank it among their top three channels. This is more than organic or paid search and display ads. Affiliate marketing is a mutually beneficial relationship. It's a top revenue source for publishers and also for the brands whose products are being promoted. Google Trends shows us that monthly searches for affiliate marketing are on the rise. Affiliate marketing is an increasingly popular way for publishers to monetize. How to create content marketing is one of the top 20 content marketing questions asked on Google. Content creators wanna know how to make money through affiliate marketing. Highlights include adding links and banners to your website's footer and sidebar, writing reviews or sharing existing reviews, leveraging email and social media, writing a list style blog and including the product in it, updating your old blog posts where relevant to include the product. 56% of affiliate advertisers and agencies increased their affiliate channel revenue starting in late March, 2020. E-commerce saw major growth during the pandemic. In 2019, online sales made up 16% of total retail sales. In 2020, that rose to 19%. Affiliate marketing is no exception. Over half of affiliate marketing programs increase their revenue during lockdown. Many changes to consumer behavior are likely to continue beyond the pandemic. This is a great time to build your following and start earning money through affiliate marketing. The fashion industry dominates affiliate marketing, accounting for 19% of programs. In second place are sports and outdoor products at 15% and health and wellness at 11%. If you run a popular fashion website, you've got a lot of affiliate programs to choose from, but that doesn't mean you can't be an affiliate marketer in a more obscure niche. All types of brands are looking for affiliates to spread the word about their products. The easiest way to find affiliate programs in your industry of choice is to simply Google product type affiliate programs. Here's another tip, spy on your competitors. Look at sites similar to yours and see if they've posted any affiliate links. The fastest growing product category for affiliate marketing is toys, with 109% growth in the last year. This is followed by software and home improvement. There are a few industries like toys and software that are up and coming in the affiliate marketing world. These industries offer big opportunities to grow your revenue. The highest share of affiliate marketing revenue comes from the retail industry with 43%. 
After that is telecom and media with 24% and travel with 16%. Most of the big opportunities in affiliate marketing come from retail. Some types of websites, like fashion blogs, have an obvious tie-in to retail. Other times, the connection isn't as obvious, but you still might be able to find retail products to promote on your site. Think about your typical audience and what type of products they might buy. Influencer marketing and affiliate marketing aren't exactly the same thing. Many influencer marketing campaigns are about promoting brand awareness rather than just sales. But 59% of brands and marketing agencies also use influencers as affiliates. Companies with affiliate programs are looking for affiliate marketers that have already gained the trust of a large audience. Sometimes that means influencers. Being an influencer in the typical sense of the word isn't a requirement for affiliate marketing, but you can take some sales hints from successful influencers in your niche. Take a look at what kind of content they create, how they engage with their followers, what keywords or hashtags they use on their website or social media. 88% of consumers say that they've decided to purchase an item based on what they saw from an influencer. A significant majority of both men and women have experienced this. You too can inspire your followers to buy a product. Many consumers are open to product referrals. Build a following of shoppers that trust you and you can be successful at promoting affiliate links. When interacting with influencer content, 64% of consumers say that they prefer watching videos. Only 38% of consumers prefer written content. 61% of consumers say they prefer images. People love videos. Here's another stat to back that up. The average person spends 2.5 hours per day watching videos online. Consider promoting your affiliate links with a video. For example, you can embed them on your blogs or landing pages or post them to social media. 77% of consumers see customer reviews as a deal breaker or deciding factor in their product purchase decision. Today's consumers are savvy. They don't just read an ad or a product description and assume the product is great. They want to hear from real people who've tried it. That's why product reviews are one of the most effective ways to promote affiliate links. Your review needs to be authentic. You're not just promoting a product, you're also establishing trust with your audience. In addition to writing your own reviews for your website, you can use third-party reviews to give your recommendation more weight. Either link to these reviews or get permission to embed or screenshot them. If you're part of the Kinsta affiliate program, you can link to our reviews landing page. That way, you can still use your affiliate link. The Amazon Associate Program dominates the affiliate marketing space with a 43% market share. Amazon is the biggest player in the game. Luckily, the Amazon Associate Program is also a lucrative program for many affiliates. The cool thing about it is that you can promote any of the millions of products on Amazon, so you can choose products that fit your niche and that you know your audience will love. There are several ways you might get paid as an affiliate marketer, but 99% of programs offer a CPA model. CPA stands for cost per action. It means you get paid for each customer that takes a particular action, almost always a sale. If you become an affiliate marketer, you'll most likely make an affiliate commission every time someone makes a purchase after following your affiliate link. However, some programs offer other payment models as well. For example, you could get paid for clicks of your link, CPC or cost per click, rather than completed sales. Publishers who have released their income reports include Pat Flynn, who grew his business from $8,000 to $100,000 per month, and Adam Enfroy, who makes $200,000 per month. Some affiliate marketers have extremely successful careers. Will you be the next affiliate marketing millionaire? According to a survey of STM forum users, 81.2% of affiliate marketers are making over $20,000 per year. Quite a few claim to be making millions. STM forum is a popular online community of affiliate marketers that requires a paid membership. In other words, most people on the forum are experienced affiliates who are serious about making money through affiliate marketing. That's going to skew the results of the survey a little. Still, the fact remains that a lot of people are making a decent income by becoming affiliate marketers. As affiliate marketing grows, the opportunity is there for you to be one of them. If you're interested in building passive income, make sure to check out Kinsta's affiliate program. 
Have questions about affiliate programs? Let us know in the comments section. Kinsta's WordPress hosting can speed up your website by up to 200%, and you'll get 24-7 support from our expert WordPress engineers. We offer two months free with any annual plan, a 30-day money-back guarantee, and unlimited free basic migrations from any host. Head over to kinsta.com slash plans to get started. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more tutorials, explainers, and helpful content like this.